Hi, it's Javi Rappaport here after a long break from the balcony of Jerusalem. As you can hear the warm sounds of Jerusalem traffic. What a better time to get back into sharing Torah wisdom than here in Jerusalem. Torah wisdom to go. What's the most expressive part of a person's face? The eyes, of course. I'm sure you've heard something like wise eyes, sad eyes, dancing eyes. I had a grandmother who had wise dancing eyes. You know, if you've ever had a makeup artist do a makeover for you, I'm sure you can relate to the fact that most of the time is spent on that perfect eye, that blend, maybe a smoky eye. Once the eye is done, hmm, the rest of the face is easy. This week's Torah portion, Re'eh, is the first word. Re'eh anochi noten lefechem hayom bracha uklala. See, I set before you today the blessing and the curse. See? What does that mean? Well, there are three ways we can serve God. One, I'm a soldier. I do what I need to. Not sure why, but I'm in. I follow orders. Two, I want to think about this. I want to get intellectually involved so that I understand the meaning of what I'm doing. And it's a lot more real to me. Wow, doesn't that sound ideal? What could be more than that? But Re'e adds a newer, a higher dimension. And that is see. See before your eyes how this is so connected to you, the relevance of it, its purposefulness. I see with my own eyes. Nobody can tell me otherwise than that the Torah and mitzvot that I do, my connection to them, to Hashem, and His to me, is so real, nobody can tell me otherwise. Now imagine, if we lived our lives that day, that way, that every action and interaction was so real to me, so pertinent, so necessary, so part of me, like 2020 vision. Wouldn't that be unbelievable? Let's try it together, you and me.